good midnight youtubers this is book edition here and yes it's actually kind of late it's already um past 3 a.m here so i'm supposed to be sleeping but because of my um lady pain issue and i had to take this um kind of a white chocolate to make sure that it, the pain will you know ease off like that so before i will go to sleep after you know recording this and do the editing in the afternoon because it's really late it's really my fault for sleeping this late so this is just a quick um, preview, hopefully it's just a quick preview of oh, this one is the um, Ichiban Kuji, the um, Kirby. So if those of you did recall of my previous previous uh, video that I've done the um, that I actually showed to you all of the Kirby table that I actually bought that at around 350 Hong Kong dollars from a Hong Kong seller here. And because of that, a few days later uh, last month, of course, I purchased yet again another item of the um, Kirby slot and this one is none other than the A price. You can tell by the topic of this video. So if those of you think I bought, I actually draw this by luck, nope, I just directly buy it because if I directly buy it, it's actually cheaper. Luckily, the store that I went to, it cost 250 Not so sure if they still have it right now, but if you want to buy it nowadays here in Hong Kong, there's one but it's actually cost 300 something or 400 the most expensive price as for now. So I already removed plastic and took some photos. So if those of you did follow me on my Instagram posts, I took a photo of it, just a few, and then one is just a random selfie of myself because like I mentioned, if those of you ladies knows about this pain thing, then yes, that's why. And here is the A price, the A show of this kawaii uh, mochi pillow or plush. It's so, so mushy. Every time I just pattern it or just lying down like this, let me uh, flat down, it's just very comfy. The material of this is very very soft, not just ordinary kind of soft, but I don't know how do you tell this kind of texture. But if those of you did uh, want this one from one of the uh, people in Japan that you actually did ask the orders from them, I'm not going to say what's their name, but I already know who are they that normally will help you do the orders. So if those of you did want this one and currently waiting for this, or are you ready? or you have already receive it then you will know the texture of this pillow it's very very comfy although it's easy to get damaged not really damaged but it, but easily to get uh, dirty my bad it's easily to get dirty because of the bright color like this is very pink so it's just a downside is it's easily to get um, dirty that's the thing and then these ones if you know these kinds of texture these ones like the paper material not really a paper these ones can and these kinds of felt easily to get damaged as well so if you don't want to make this very dirty or let like younger kids like always like to draw on the um, toys like my niece no offense but my niece does a lot i had to prevent um giving this to her like literally no matter what but i can tell you like i let you all see the detail on this very very kawaii 30 cm um, plush oh yes and before that here is the uh, tag for official that this is definitely the a price of this uh mochi uh, kirby plush right here this is so honto honto kawaii and then here's the back as proof right here even the label of the kirby and then the ones attached underneath you can see that logo down there saying ban presto but because i'm carrying it i kind of flip it around like that because it's already tired i mean i'm already tired my bad and then you can see the detail that the stitch it that they the stitch that the company attached right here of the cherry blossom or the chakra on top looks like like the girl theme and then this one is the leaf to make it like the mochi theme and i noticed that when they made kirby uh kirby lay down in this kind of pose like that you can see it even the back it really looks like a mochi theme the mochi of the japanese kind of a sweet dessert those kinds so i got to admit that it's very creative for the people there whether it's N nintendo or the brand presto they absolutely capture its theme and make it the represent of a mochi food in of course in japan it's so creative and it makes you just want to should i not eat the mochi because now i just remember kirby it's like you feel innocent or the guilt of eating it because it kind of represents kirby but for me it's just so cute even if i see those one day if i ever go to go back to japan oh my goodness i just remember is oh it's the kirby but i've no choice but to eat you because it's so delicious but it doesn't mean you're eating kirby of course 
But anyways, looking at the detail right here, you can see even the cheeks right here. Not really easy to tell, but you can only see this when I either uh, move it down a bit like that without the uh, you know the light. You can see that there's some uh, blush right here, like Dundable blush. And then here's the uh, eyes and then the mouth stitched very well. Even the stitches, you can see they stitch it very well right here. Not like in just one straight, but like every uh, corners to make sure that the felt inside it will stay you know concealed. And then what my sister Natnar told me that this one is not just kind of a stitching like you see in these lines, right? This one is very different, but I'm not so sure of the name. Like since I'm not really um, you know good at making or sewing or making plush dolls, so no, so no offense. My sister said these kinds of materials you need to have a specific kind of a needle, something to make a plush. But this one it takes very long, so. My sister was very surprised that whoever make these plushes, like a tons of it, like how many like that because this is only two slots and those of you are planning to do the draw, there's only two of this one out of like how many, I think 60 or 70 slots for this Kirby Lottery uh, from last month on July 20th. And you can see the stitches, they have done it very very well. So if those of you make plush and watching this video, I think you may know. What I'm referring to, like stitching, like just cotton, maybe not really cotton, but stitching the way every corner, it takes really time. My sister said that she knows, but she just don't know the name, so I cannot really put it anywhere or even Google it. But if those of you knows about it, um, please do comment on this video if you do know of what I'm referring to, and. Because of the material that I felt for right, this one, I remember that there is this um, lottery that I drawn uh, last month on December, which is the Mina no Kuji, not Ichiban Kuji, but Mina no Kuji of the Full Metal Alchemist. So those of you who did watch that one, probably you or may not know about this, but I will just have this a recap right here. This is the A shot, the A price right here, and also two slots, but. Uh, right now they don't have it so here's just a quick look and the material the the comfiness the fabric were bad it's similar very very the same so I was really surprised the moment I touched this one of Kirby of course it may instantly I recalled of Alphonse right here so I was really really surprised that both of them for the Minano Kuji and the Ichiban Kuji both of these uh, fabric the material are the same it's just color different the images are different but if it's for the um, the comfiness as you're as I'm feeling it right now right here it's definitely the same so those of you did have this one or curious how the heck am I gonna get how the heck are you gonna get it it's gonna be hard but you can try to type it Mina no Kuji like that and then try to see or hope for the best if you can try to hunt this down because this one was released on December um, something but that was last year 2017 so I can just give you a hint that this one the material of this the fabric is definitely 100% close to this one very very close so not really 100 but let's say 90% like that so in overall to um, before to end this video in my conclusion, I'm really really happy to uh, get this one instead of getting it for 400 Hong Kong dollars or above but purchasing this for 250 which is already considered as cheap. It's already a good amount for me that I use it in a, you know, instead of like doing the pull like that, you just uh, directly buy because if you're, uh, if you're on budget mode or you just want to get a certain price that you want, then just go for it like me. I just want the table, I just get it. But instantly, I also want to get this, and I still have the budget that time from last month, so I used it. And no regrets for um, getting this, despite my room is going to be smaller again, so I have to reorganize everything. And tomorrow, I'm still going to be staying at home because of this um, pain, and the weather is still typhoon number one. So, um, 44 buyers are currently waiting, uh, three from the States, USA and one to Germany I hope you be um, I hope you understand because if I go out it's still bad weather and it's a weekend so weekends the post office are, cl are currently closed and the uh, typhoon is not going to go away until maybe around a few more days so please be patient and I ho do hope you will understand so anyways I have to end this video and all I could say about this um, Kirby plush or mochi plush in my own 
uh, terms to say because that's how they translated in Japanese to English. So if you did enjoy this um, preview of the A Price um, plush doll, Kirby plush mochi doll, um, give this video the thumbs up and let me know what are your um, thoughts or your opinion about this very Honto Kawaii mochi plush Kirby. So feel free to comment below and feel free to subscribe to my channel to see more anime previews and Kuju previews to share with you all in the later future. So until then everyone, see you all in the next anime preview and say bye bye to Kirby right here. Bye bye.